every time I, I hear the name of this band, I just think about deep sea fishing, like catching marlins and sailfish oh, yeah. and stuff. But it's not real like R.E.A.L. It's De- real like movies. Definitely you think that that's a play on it, though. Like, think, obviously. Yeah, like, yeah. It's a, I got a real, yeah. but they're a musical band. But then you reel in the big fish. Oh, maybe they were fishermen. Maybe. Yeah. Hey, they say that I'm talking a whole lot of trash I'm sitting there thinking like, who knew? I know that you've seen us on Rappers React They're talking about us on YouTube Hollywood 6, it look like I do magic Maybe he's practicing voodoo I'm hearing you're getting a lot of attention Well, I'm here to say that we do To deliver the rubbish I'm... What's going on, everybody? We're back with another segment of Rappers React Smoke Dog What up? I happen to have um, some tribute for I you. bet you do in what organ of the human body would you find the bronchi? The bronchi? Bronchi. In what organ? Yes. In what organ of the human body would you find the, the, the lungs? Oh, You're correct, my yeah. friend. It is the lung. I'm kind of between the lungs and the esophagus. Yeah. All right. Uh, how about this? You better get this right. What soft drink company adopted Santa as a spokesman? Oh, that's, that's way too easy. There. That's Coca-Cola. You're correct, my friend. You're correct. All right. Uh, how about this one? I'm going to give you another easy one. Mm. You better get this one right, too, Smoke <laughs> Dog. Right. How many pieces of bun are in a McDonald's Big Mac? Oh, that's three. <laughs> You're correct, my friend. You're correct. All yeah, right. I always wonder why does it have two bottles? That's a good question. And then the middle one's like a like a weird like just it's like a cut off. Yeah. You know, I don't it's know. It's like they just had a tall bun and cut it in the middle. Of the <laughs> Where? Hey, somebody go to McDonald's and say, just let me get a, a double cheeseburger with the middle of the Mac. But yeah, uh, just put two bun bottles. But, on yeah. There, and then you got a big Mac. Big Mac. Yeah. All right. Um. Uh, who, what, when, where? Uh, uh, oh man, that's real nice. I've always wanted one of those. Can I blank that? Have. All right. Common phrase. Me and you. Uh, what was the first one again? Uh, who, what, when, where have you been? You got it, my friend. <laughs> guys, before we get started, please do us a big, big, big favor, y'all. Please hit that thumbs up button. Guys, please subscribe to the channel. Have a guy sight. Leave us a comment. And tell us what to react to next. That's how we get out of this video. Videos come directly from you. Right down in our comment section and over on Patreon. And today, we have another wonderful suggestion from one of our wonderful Patreon members who goes by the name of... One, one arm, arm retro, retro gamer. <laughs> Shout out to you, one arm retro gamer, because yeah. please let us know if your name is accurate, because that'd be awesome if you're a one yeah. arm retro gamer. Salute to you. Yeah, because absolutely. 100%, you are a loyal Patreon member, my friend. Okay, guys, if you want to support us, best way to do that is through Patreon. More on that later in the video. But one armed mm-hmm. retro gamer. At first glance, I thought he was armed. That's what I thought. Like he, he plays Mario and then he goes out on a spree. He <laughs> pauses it. Just, <laughs> yeah. All right, I'm back. <laughs> We're making light. That's like a, a what was it, angry video game nerd. Oh man, I, I, <laughs> that fool gets so mad sometimes. He want to shoot people. Dude, that dude creates curse words. That <laughs> just, <laughs> shout out to James Wolf, man. That dude's yeah. awesome, man. But no, all right. One of Retro Gamer has sent us over a band that we have only done one song by Smoke Dog. Uh, yeah, real big fish. Yes. Yeah, we we did take on me, but the ska. Yeah, the cover. ska version. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, that's uh, really all I know about Real Big Fish is they were a ska band Same. during that big boom of ska in the 90s. 90s. What would you say? Like mid, late 90s? I would say mid, yeah. Because yeah, yeah, you had the, uh, like, No Doubts or Jamming. Yeah. Oh, I got a question Cherry, for you. Well, I guess Cherry Pop and Daddy's were more of a swing band, right? Yeah. yeah. All right, you remember that song, completely off topic, but or on, this, on the ska thing, but remember... Uh, uh, that big Santana song dur- around that time during the ska, the and uh, it's just like the laser, just like the feel you like the sweetest little moment that I ever seen. Yeah, yeah that's uh, okay. and the Matchbox and 20 guy. So, was that song ska smooth? Yes, that's what it was called. Uh, come on, man, that's uh, <laughs> I don't know. See, like the ocean. I don't know if you could consider it ska. I mean, it's hard, it's Maybe. weird to say Santana Scott, but yeah, I, I exactly. get. I feel like that song had a kind of a 
I, I don't know. Like, I feel like I'm outside in New York playing cards. It definitely and, had a New York vibe. Yes, man. <laughs> My Spanish, what do you say, Spanish Harlem Mona Spanish Harlem Mona Lisa? Something like that, yeah. yeah. I don't know. But with real, real Big Fish, do you think they're from the States? You think It sounds like New York, or at least Northeast. You know, you got the Mighty Mighty Ball Stones. Ooh. It feels like that our version of Sky yeah. came out of the Northeast. Okay. Uh, originally, it came from the Caribbean. Caribbean, but, yeah, with yeah. the horns and stuff. Mm-hmm. Where have you been? What you got? Where, well, man? Don't, don't, don't. <laughs> 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 I don't know. I'm probably just seeing the <laughs> old friend came back. Smoke dog. What up? Let's get into it. Let's do it. God damn. Hold on. That's a hell of a cover. <laughs> That's a. If anybody is looking at you, <laughs> grabbing you by the shirt with a cigar and mean face like that, telling you to cheer up, <laughs> you better cheer you up. Like, you better be happy. I'm a clown, damn it. <laughs> Smile, you. <laughs> <laughs> Called me up last night in tears And said you missed me after all these years well, I've been waiting here so long I've gotten over it since you've been gone With your new boyfriend Asked if you could come back home So sorry that you left me all alone Well, say you love me You love me again But if you love me Where have you been? You say you need me more than anyone else will go to hell Why do you push me away? Your life with him was just so dull But what we had was something wonderful Well, say you love me, love me again But if you love me, where have you been? You say you need me more than Oh, yeah. It'd be great. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, something we didn't touch on in the beginning is that that version of ska kind of grew out of the punk scene yeah. in the Northeast. It did have a punk vibe to oh, it. Oh, yeah, bit. very pop punk. Yeah, yes. Yeah, absolutely. And we're, I, I wasn't talking about the, the lyric meaning, but literally, you could take this, the, the, uh, theme music from Friends. So no one told you life was gonna, gonna be, be this way. way. <laughs> Take that into where have you? I could just see like Kramer I walking through the work. door. Even, <laughs> <laughs> even the lyrics would work though. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. For it. Oh uh, Jerry. <laughs> <laughs> Man. But okay, now when it first started, bro, I'm mm. hearing. I, I ain't gonna lie. I thought we was gonna get some. Some uh, come on, give me the voice. The uh, oh, the pop come punk on, voice. I, I thought we was gonna get. Well, that. I, I, thought, right I thought we was gonna get some of that, <laughs> but then it got a little pop punky. Yeah, you know, yeah. sky yeah. highest. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, it's crazy how many genres actually grew out of the punk scene around the Northeast. Facts. It's so many of them, man. man. It was like, I mean, think about it. Uh, everything from. Uh, grunge, you know, I mean, I guess that kind of mm. happened in the Northwest, in the Northwest but you know. still so many different genres grew out of the hardcore, you know, post-punk, hmm. so many scenes grew out of it. You, yeah. So, you you know, you're bringing up the Northeast, you know, a band or a, a genre of music that's popular in like the kind of Northeast, you know, the DMV area is mm-hmm. go-go music. Yeah. I, to this day, I have no idea what go-go music sounds like. I mean, that was originally Caribbean too. I trash talkers, please tell me a song. Do you know like a song that is str- like nothing but go go? I hear uh, I, I have a friend that lives in Maryland. They're like, oh yeah, that's the go go scene, and I'm yeah, like, what it does it sound around, like around uh, Baltimore? Yeah. Around, and, yeah, and and to me, what I from what people have like described it as is like they s- describe it as a punk. So maybe go go kind of came out of punk too. Maybe yeah. I, yeah. Oh, I wouldn't doubt it. I don't know. I've never. I don't know what a. Punk, I think. I, I think mean, that's what it was. Though. It's like the punk scene up there just started experimenting with different sounds. You know, you bring in the horns like. They were influenced by Caribbean music, yeah. so you you get ska, you get go go, things like that. You would think, bringing in the Caribbean vibe, why isn't it like ska bigger? Or am I tripping? Why is it like you would think it'd be like big in like Louisiana with the Caribbean and mm-hmm. French and no? Is that is that not a thing? Or am oh, I tripping? I don't know that there is a big scene. Well, I don't know. Maybe. I mean, now you got me thinking about New Orleans, like. Jazz. jazz like is there like a mix of jazz and punk because with the ska coming yeah, out there of, is, yeah. it's i mean music is freaking worldwide man it <laughs> it's is, yeah. every, there's a genre yeah, everywhere. it's crazy like think about sublime you yes. know they're out on the west coast and they started adding reggae and all yes. this in ska caribbean yeah I'm, because i think that was bradley actually took a trip when he was a kid to to jamaica and yeah. ended up picking up on the the music scene there I don't know, man. Either way, dude, the the genre is so big and real big fish. You know, you guys have to let us know. Are they? Do you think they're one of the big four of oh, Scott? Scott? Yeah, you would think. Mighty Mighty Ballstone's got to be number one. Sublime. Is Sublime? Yeah, I mean it's not Northeast, but uh, they were definitely one of the big ska influenced bands. No doubt. Yeah, yeah, you gotta add no doubt. Real big fish. Maybe trash talkers, Maybe. Uh, one-armed retro gamer. I mean, unless you know, a lot of times people consider well to be one of the big four. You got to be where the music uh, originated. Yeah. So that would take the California guys out of yeah. it. Yeah. I mean, you guys let us know. One-armed yeah. retro gamer. But what is the big four of Scott? Scott. Yeah. I do want to quickly touch on the lyrics because I think it's pretty much on the nose. Mm-hmm. It's like dudes out tr- uh, or she's out. Oh yeah. Know, yeah, I mean, we've all had that happen, right? I think, you know, you have a breakup, and you know, your your ex is with somebody else, and then when that goes wrong, they're back at your door. The question is, is if you, like he said, if you love me, the question is, is do you really want to know? Like, do you <laughs> yeah. really? Do, you know, what yeah. I mean? it's like I know it, but I just need to hear it out of your mouth. Yeah, like I know you was with old Jody, mm-hmm. but I just need to hear you say, like, <laughs> really want me to tell Jody was clapping. Jody. <laughs> Hundred <laughs> percent. But yeah, that, that's the question, right? Like, if you really love me that much, like, why were you gone? Yeah, that's a fact, man. Like, you left, so obviously there was a point in time where you didn't feel that way. Hundred percent. Or you just weren't faithful to what mm-hmm. I was offering, and she's like, "I need to go." It, it men or women, because yeah. I ain't gonna lie, me and yeah, Smokey did it probably too. A certain gender? No, yeah. not at all. Hundred like, percent. There's people that you know they they. 
need that attachment. Like, as soon yeah. as they're off of one person, they need immediately to be on to someone else. Yeah. I mean, I've been down that road before, man, 100%. Mm -hmm. Listen, one on Retro Gamer, we greatly, greatly appreciate you telling us to check out uh, God damn, Real Big Fish. Real Big Fish, where have you been? Mm -hmm. Greatly appreciate it. Again, guys, if you want to support us, the best way to do that is through Patreon, only $5 a month. Put your video in rotation, shows your preview of the video that comes out the day before it actually comes out. We've got suggestions, we've got threads amongst many other things, but ultimately, it helps me and Smokey put these videos out. We do every single day, and one arm Retro Gamer just gave you a prime example as to why being a Patreon member helps us out so much here. Absolutely. 100%. Guys, give us your top four of Ska down mm -hmm. in the comment section and let us know what we do next by Real Big Fish as well. And with that being said, my name is Barry Ridge of Hollywood 6. Bye. I am Larry Smokey Ramirez. Come and we are over and out. Douche. Yeah, boy. Yeah. <laughs> Snap, clap, clap, clap. I want to thank you guys for spending a little bit of time with us today. If you want to see the last video we did, just click right over here. Or if you want to see another artist that we covered, just click right over here. If you guys want to support the channel, please consider joining our Patreon right over here. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and we'll see you on the next one. Deuces.